you know, how did you get into DevOps in general? Because I, I mean, there's not a lot of uh, female engineers in just in software in general, let alone DevOps, right? I'm really curious about your journey, you know, leading up yeah. to this. Well, I was a music major in school and I had a crush on a boy in the computer labs and uh, I started hanging out there. I'm a very um, oppositional personality. So when I, as soon as I saw these computer labs that were full of dudes and no women, I was like, aha, I belong here. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, you know, so I got my first sysadmin gig at the university um, and it just kind of grew from there. I really, I really enjoy you know, I, I think that, you know, computers are, are in this generation just as much of an art as a science. Um, there's, you know, it's, it's, they're kind of beyond our ability to grasp using very simple, you know, mental models. And so you kind of have to use them enough to get a real sense for the flavor and the, and the, um, the, the feel of them. And, you know, I just kept building bigger and bigger systems. And I was really fortunate in the teams that I get to work with, because, you know, this, this entire industry is such a, it's, it's such a vocational, it's an apprenticeship industry, right? Mm -hmm. Where, you know, you get to be a great engineer by getting to work with other great engineers and seeing how, how well they do things and like carrying those lessons forward. 